Well, I always kind of chuckle when I, I have a question or think about Middle Mile because I would have known nothing about this four or five years ago. I mean, this is just out of my realm of thinking about it. Uh, but I've learned about all this since then. So, for example, after the last recession in 2008, uh, there is a lot of stimulus money that was spent. And in North Carolina, a huge amount of that stimulus money at the state level was spent in building out a, a infrastructure, an internet infrastructure connecting all the universities and all the uh, schools in the state in a very sophisticated high-speed uh, network throughout the entire state. Now that doesn't really help the library down the street if they're not part of that network and so the middle mile language is how do you run fiber from the extended network that connects all of the universities and all the K-12 schools. Uh, so how do you run fiber from that network to the library? And that's where middle mile gets uh, referred to. And in North Carolina, we have a great organization called ERC Broadband, which provides middle mile services for nonprofit organizations, educational organizations, and governmental units to help them connect into the uh, core of the internet uh, network. So that's middle mile, and there's some federal money that's been set aside for middle mile expansion. And we're hopeful that uh, we'll get some of those dollars here to help build out the middle mile network. And ERC broadband, interestingly, has a very extensive middle mile network throughout Western North Carolina. And uh, they can, of course, speak for themselves about that, but it's, it's, it's fascinating what they do. Uh, the second category uh, that's in the federal bill that's kind of similar is the dollars for the Native American reservations. And there's a fair amount of money that's set aside for the uh, reservations. Now, this is unclear to me to what extent the Eastern Band of the Cherokee Indians will want to apply for and utilize because they've actually done a very nice job on the reservation of uh, connecting their residents and they may not either be eligible for these dollars nor need these dollars as much as other uh, Native American uh, tribes. So we will see how that uh, plays out, but it can be very helpful uh, to these uh, Native American uh, uh, communities over the coming months. So those two pots of money aren't talked a lot about uh, when we talk about broadband, but I think might be quite significant. 